What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Just Rain, and I'm back with another video. Rain, this way. Uh, what's up? What's up? What's up? Today, we're going to talk about what's in my makeup kit. Um, as a makeup artist, I like to try different products. I like to try products that are high-end. I like to try products that are a little, um, what can we say? Discounted. <laughs> No, I do like to try inexpensive products and products that are high-end. So let's get into it. Um, first things first, I want to start off with foundation. I have, oh, my daughter is back there too, if you hear, hear baby. Um, I have Black Radiance foundation. Now, this foundation was actually on sale at, um, at Myers for $2.99. And when I saw that, I was like, let me give it a try because I've never tried Black Radiance Foundation. And, um, hold on, guys. Are you okay? Are you okay, you Buddhist? Okay. So I've never tried Black Radiance Foundation, so I decided to give it a try. I bought two bottles because they were $2.99. So I tried it out, and I love the coverage. I love the finish. It's definitely buildable. So I stopped up. So I have Black Radiance Foundation here. Okay. I have L'Oreal True Match. I have L'Oreal High Intensity Pigment. Um, you can't, you can never go wrong with your LA Pro Concealer. You can never go wrong with having these guys. Um, so there has been times where I'm like, okay, I don't have time to go to the mall, I don't have time to go to Target, and I've actually uh, bought foundation from the beauty supply, and this is absolute foundation. Now this, I would use this product if I didn't have any other option, like, at all. So it's an okay, it's an okay product to use. Um, I have MAC, uh, now I'm getting, oh, one more foundation. We have MAC Studio Fix Fluid, which works really, really well, and that's what I'm wearing right now, actually. Um, we have Maybelline, Maybelline Fit Me. I love this, this is so good. I've used this for a few clients, and I love it, okay? Uh, we have MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. Uh, you guys know I use my LA Pro Girl Concealers as well. I love I love Mac. I I can't work for Mac. I'll tell you that I can't work for anybody. But I love, um, I love the product. Okay, and then I have this Mac Waterway Concealer that I use for my eyebrows, which is really good as well. Okay, guys. So now that we got into foundations, I'm gonna just you know I'm gonna just go through the kit. I got this uh, glitter from Wet and Wild. I'm gonna show you guys a swatch. I got this glitter from Wet n Wild and it was only 99 cent at Myers, and it works so good. It looks so good on my clients. Uh, when I did work for Matt guys, I got a bunch of little sample cups and at the time they were launching a glitter line. So I got some glitter in these little sample cups and I've had it for like maybe a couple months now because people don't necessarily use glitter all the time. So I just have glitter kind of just sitting around. Um, I did say that I was gonna do the Young Miami Glitter Lip. Like if you've seen her video with Cardi B, the twerk video, uh, she had a glitter lip, lip that was so hot, so popping, and you don't really see too many people rocking a glitter lip. So I did say I was gonna do a video on that. If you wanna see me do a video on that, go ahead and leave a comment below and say, yes, do it, boo, and I'll do a video on that, okay? <laughs> Um, I have a lip scrub for my clients, so say for instance if someone came and their lips were kind of like peeling or they were chapped, I would apply the lip scrub before I do any lipstick just so, you know, the lipstick, the lipstick can apply smoothly, okay? Uh, I have mascara, and with this mascara, this is Great Lash, with this, I honestly think like once you find a product that works for you, you stick to it. I've been buying this mascara for years, okay? Hold on. You okay, Pooh? I've been buying this mascara for years.
this guy. So that's why I got it this time. Um, I do have this YSL. This is a YSL mascara, but it has like a shine to it. My husband bought it for uh, Mother's Day last year. I was okay, uh, babe. I'm gonna put this in my kit because I'm sure somebody would really like this really fancy and then it was a time where i was very very desperate and i bought some mascara for a dollar and 49 cents and it was the worst decision i have ever made in my life i should just throw this out right now because it's too thick it's it is lash enhancer natural mascara black by response not good whatsoever response i'm sorry but, um I have here liquid liquid last liner by Mac. Um, I have a few liquid last liners by Mac. Okay. Okay, so let's let's continue. Um, I have the travel size fix plus spray. Just when like if I'm traveling to a client's house or something like that, I don't like to get, bring large bottles. I like to bring, you know, travel size items so I won't be traveling with so much, especially with the baby. You know, and, and also I, I learned like when you travel light, you're able to you're able to maneuver better. Okay. Um, so I have that. I have a little sample from um I went to let me think of this store. I went to Chanel. Uh-oh. Yeah, I went to Chanel because I wanted to try a high-end foundation. Uh, it was so ugly on me. It, it was so ugly. But anyways, I wanted to try a high-end foundation, so I went to Chanel, and uh, they gave me a sample of their primer. I used this primer one time, but I will say that the primer works really well. Um, however, the foundation from Chanel was not that great. You know, I feel like I'm a, I'm a MAC girl at heart. I am a MAC girl. I also have MAC Liquid Eyeliner. Um, this works so great. I love it because the applicator just gives you uh, per the perfect precision to draw a wing liner. I love this, okay? Uh, let's see. Ooh, yeah. Uh, Benet Banana Powder. You know something? This, oh, I had to check on her. You know something? This powder has literally saved my life. And the reason why it's still some left is because when I first got it, I didn't know how to use it. But as I once I learned how to use it, it works wonders for my skin, especially in the oily areas. I love it for a highlight. I, I just love banana powder. Okay, uh, so I do have banana powder. Uh, I have the Mac Warm Neutral Palette. A lot of my clients they like soft glam natural makeup, so. I thought that this would be a good investment. I believe this palette is $64 too. So I thought this would be a good investment for my kit. Um, let's see. I have this huge e.l.f. palette that I got uh, a little while ago. I don't really use it that often, but if I do have a client who wants something more jazzy, they want to have blue, green, purple, I got this palette, which works just as, just as good. As a matte palette, I have this contour and contour and blush six color palette by BH Cosmetics. I got this when I was like out shopping at Kohl's, and um, I was just browsing their makeup department, and I was like, "Ooh, let me try this." <laughs> so I have that. Um, I have. Oh, you guys saw that. Um, a blush palette this this palette was created by my mentor she created this palette and um, she just bought I'm not sure if she got the blushes from Mac or what where she got it from but uh, she did gift it to me and I've had it ever since and it's awesome Oh, so whenever I get new clients when they come to when they travel to my home because I do do makeup out of my house uh, when they travel to my home if they you know if they pay for if they pay additional for a mask or if they have any skin issues I will offer uh, a mask I do have this reset revive charcoal mask 
that works really good for the skin it cleans out the pores it's so awesome so i recommend this to my clients who are having issues with their skin before i do their makeup uh i have the elf daily brush cleaner this is good in between clients and like in between like say for instance if i uh, have a client who has a wedding and you know i have to do four to five girls this is really good to clean my brushes in between time and i love it uh the daily brush cleaner by elf let's see now this here is ultra soothe ultra smoothing matte primer usually before i start a makeup application i ask the client you know do you have oily skin or do you have dry skin and that determines what primer I'm going to put on them. Now this is for my oily girls. I have this right here. And I'm just digging for gold, guys. Now this is a Skin Smoothing Primer by CoverGirl, which is really good. I use this for my skin all over because it is the winter time here in Michigan. I like for my skin to be She's so quiet, guys. I did not even know. Like, <laughs> I thought she was asleep for a second. But anyways, I like for my skin to be hydrated. So I love this CoverGirl True Blend um, Primer. This right here, child. I need some more of this. This is MAC Cleanse Off Oil. I use this. Say, for instance, you want to do a uh, glitter eye or a smoky eye. This is perfect. With, like, if you use a Q-tip, you can just easily get the um, get the fallout off the face. The other day, I had a client who wanted like a dramatic eye. She said she wanted to look gothic. And I was so mad that I didn't bring this because I was trying to travel light and I did not bring this. I was so mad because it was so hard to get off the fallout. And the fallout is like the eyeshadow that falls on the face. It was so hard to wipe that off her face with just a makeup wipe. It was, it was like the worst ever. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, this here is the contour cream kit. I usually use this kit to color correct. I haven't really contoured with this kit, but um, I mean, I, I know I probably will eventually, but I usually use this to color correct and conceal. Random, you know when you're at the when you're at uh, the drugstore and you see an eyeshadow palette and you're like, ooh, I really love those colors. This is so random. I've never really used it, never really had to use it, but um, you know what? I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna give it a try one day. I will. Uh, this is another another palette. This for eyeshadows. I was using this for my brows. For my client's brows, I was using that. All right, so we have another eyeshadow palette. Remember, I told you guys I was at Kohl's and I bought that contour kit. I got this eyeshadow palette as well, and I've been using it. I also have nail glue in my kit. Every so, I mean, like, once a week, I go through, clean my brushes and everything like that. And if I have a brush that's trying to fall apart, like, if the the head is trying to come off the the, the stick, I would super glue it down. Okay. This little guy is random. You know what? This is actually Black Radiance, and I didn't even realize it. It's Black Radiance, but it's, it's a foundation, but it's kind of like a mousse. And it reminds me of Fashion Fair. Um... You know what, I bought this and it came in handy one time when I was doing a wedding. I didn't have the girl's color and this was the closest thing I had to her color, okay? And we made this work, boo. We made this work and I use, I also used this contouring palette. Ooh, yeah, we made that work. She likes it, it, it came out really cute. Uh, let's see. I also have Santa 
sanitizer in my kit because you know no one wants you to touch their face with dirty hands so I'm actually using some and take a sip of my water mm. yeah so I have sanitizer in my kit now this was rose water but I used all the rose water and I poured alcohol in it and I literally used this to disinfect my entire kit or you know just just to keep the bacteria and germs away I used alcohol to disinfect my kit and I am actually urged to just do like this it doesn't hurt uh let's get into it I have this true match lumi glow lotion I love it especially on my 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 melanin my melanin sisters uh my melanated sisters <laughs> I love the Lumi Glotion. It looks so good in the high, like, you know, the cheekbones, down the nose. I love this. And it, there's even been times where I didn't have on any makeup, but I put the Glow Lotion on, and it looks so good, guys. This was a good buy. It was 12 bucks, but I don't regret buying it. Uh, oh, we have a concealer in the wrong spot. I have Color, Cover Girl Concealer um, for my Caucasian clients. Now this Mega Glow by Wet n Wild. Now I've already uh, observed that Wet n Wild is like a lower end brand. However, this this right here, this um, highlighting, this liquid highlighter is so good. Like I don't have any complaints about this. My clients haven't had any complaints. I've been rapping with this. Uh, we have here lens cleaner so whenever i go to my clients uh homes if i have to travel to their homes i would bring a mirror and i have this so i can clean the mirror off so i'm gonna grab a handful of these because i have some really cute cute lipstick colors Let's see. i have this in nyx this is actually what i'm wearing right now this one Darker. I have um, Ruby Kisses. These are so cute. Okay, these are so cute. Uh, I do have a few MAC lipsticks. I have MAC lip liquid lipsticks. Uh, let's see. I have MAC lip gloss. I have uh, coconut oil lip gloss. actually has a bottom half to it oh yeah and what I like about this kit is like if it, it sits all the way up right so then say for instance I'm able to sit like I can sit my water here or like I can sit I have a brush uh, holder I can sit the brush holder here mm. all right so Let's get into the bottom of the kit. Hold on one second, guys. Just trying to see what time it is. My husband said she wants to come. Box for traveling. Yes, I want to fit everything in here. 
I don't want to bring anything extra, which I end up bringing something extra. But all right, guys. So last but not least, I have a shoulder wrap. Um, it is a microwavable aromatherapy wrap. So you can either heat this or you can freeze it. Um, each temperature does something different. So before the client comes by, I assess them. I ask, have you had any tension? You know, what are some of your issues? And then I determine whether or not it should be heated or it should be frozen. And literally while they get their makeup done, they can relax with the um, shoulder wrap. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching my video. Um, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Lane, lane, lane this way.